Hi, my dear friends, Chris here. I hope you're doing well. Um, so today I have for you an unboxing from uh, a new company for me. The first time I've ever uh, unboxed anything from them. They are called DIY Buying. Um, I will, of course, link all of the products. I have five items for you today. So I'll link all of the items down in the description box below. Um, and, and as well, of course, Please, if you'd like to join my Facebook group that I share with my friend Angie from Angie Diamond Painting Adventures, that would be very lovely. Just answer the questions, please, to be approved. And um, yeah, you'll find that in the description box. And bef so before I go right into the uh, show and tell portion, I just wanted to say I don't know the provenance of these items so um, or the, any kind of legality of it. So, um, you know, just keep that in mind and if that's something that matters to you and thank you for watching okay so let's get right into it I have four bubble rounds and one special drill that's purely a special drill so let's get on to the first one um let's see what do they call it? this is the yeah this is what I call her too it's like the back view of a girl I'm gonna say like someone in a spring day you know Maybe at a wedding or something. <laughs> That's what's going on in my mind. Um, so let's see. This has 19 shapes, colors, and sizes. It's a 30 by 40 com total canvas. Not the picture, the total canvas. Okay, here is the thumbnail of it. So that's the picture. Uh, the code. Here is the legend. And while we're here, let's take a tour of the drill field. You can see the different sizes. You can see special shapes there in the hair, in the head, in her head um, headpiece. As you can see, the different sizes here. little piece of grass so honestly this isn't my favorite design however you know me I love my bubble rounds so this is basically more just one that I got for fun now while I do love a lot of the images I do get some of them sometimes are just more for fun and this is more of a just for fun just for me personally just not one of my favorite images I don't hate it or anything but you know that's just my feeling so um but it might be it might um come it's i'm sure it's going to come out beautiful especially if you look at the picture that they show you on the website it's of it basically finished already and you can see the bright blues and her beautiful um hair and the pink dress so it's going to be a really pretty image again this is from diy buying okay so let's look at the diamonds real quick this is CU083. Okay. Oops. I was like, oh, did I get the wrong one? But no, I was looking at uh, the opposite uh, numbers. Okay. So, and that's also I'm going to mention. Um, always, no matter where you buy from, whether it's a budget-friendly company or a premium company, always check their codes to make sure they align with the diamonds or if the diamond painting has a name, you know, make sure the name is also on the diamonds, you know, just double check to make sure you have everything and count the, the drills and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so let's go through these real quick. So this is the background color. It's like um, it's a like a very pretty blue, like a periwinkle, I would call it. It's hard to see because of the silver backings, but it is very nice. And here it is in the larger shape um, size, or the medium, I should say. Um, these are clear. Mm 
this one is a very extremely light brown. I mean, I wouldn't even call it brown. It looks, it looks like it's a clear with just like a drop of brown in it. Champagne-y maybe kind of color. This is a very pretty color. Don't see this too often, I don't think. It's extremely, again, very light pink with a touch of purple maybe. No, maybe not. It's extremely light pink, yeah. Usually you see these, the much brighter pinks. Here we have some, these pretty star AB diamonds kind of things. Marquees, 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 some teardrops. And again, these are the, the white, um, the white um, star, they're small. Very nice. Oops, no, let me fold it this way so I could see the code when I look for it. So again, here we have our girl. Now our second one is same sort of colors. Hold on a second. Let me just get that off here. Doo -doo. Now you'll all know this character um, from a cartoon series, The Little Pig. Isn't it cute? Again, we have a 30 by 40. It's 15 shapes, colors, and sizes. Thumbnail, the night I'm not number. Again, let's take a look at the drill field. Like usual, all these are always so clear. These are very st sticky. No issues with that. Um, since I'm doing this format, how I display it, of course, uh, to, to you all, I, I um, take these out when I get them. I lay them flat under um, something heavy, you know, just to try to save as much time as I can because, I don't, you know, sometimes my videos can go a little long and rambly. So, and again, I apologize for the blurriness of this. I have not perfected this part yet. I don't know how to fix that. <laughs> but there he is uh, all diamond up <laughs> all right let's take a look at the diamonds so we have lots of clears these are the background colors the clear then we have the medium size clear and large and we have pinks Oh, I was going to say, I am missing a lot, <laughs> but it was in, it's in two separate <laughs> uh, trains. I was like, oh no. Okay, let's continue. So here we have light pink again, pretty light pinks. Two um, very light lilac purple, a medium purple. A little black and the one I think one special shape is this little marquee here that'll go in the body area okay so let's Mm -hmm. Let's take one last look. See, as I said, the background will be all clear and the pig will be pink, of course. <laughs> and the outfit is going to be what's the purple colors. Okay. So let's do that. Now, this is really cute. I don't know where this is from. If it's from anywhere, I'm not sure. 
Um, but it's a little, it's again, 30 by 40. We have 17 color shapes and sizes, another bubble round, of course. And we have a bear with a cute little um, winter hat on. And we have some um, large snowflake type things in the background. Okay, again, thumbnail, that's what he looks like. We have the item number. And we have the legend, again, 17, if I didn't say that. And let's look at the drill field. Okay, and here he is from the site. And let's look at diamonds. So like usual, if you, I'd appreciate it greatly if you like and comment. Tell me what you... you uh, what you like here, um, have you ever bought anything from DIY buying? Oh, I didn't tell you. Uh, meanwhile, I have it written down, but I forgot to tell you um, the shipping time. So I was um, ordered around October 15th and it was delivered here on October 29th. Oh, I don't, my calendar changed. I can't see. So, um, you know. That's pretty good, about two weeks, right? Something about that. All of these come in really fast for me at least, usually between two, three weeks at the most from any of these companies. So I really like that ship time. And generally I also find too that a lot of times, half the time or more is usually spent when the item's actually here in the US, not so much when it travels across sea or when it's placed, that's actually a lower time. But for whatever reason, it's slower moving through our own system than it is from China to here. But anyways, what can you do, right? Two weeks is still fine. I'm not gonna complain about that at all. So we have our regular size and our mediums. And we have some clear large ones, some blacks. Uh, regular drill, some white regular. We have some medium white and the large white. So of course the white is going to be the bear itself and the black will be the outline. The blue is the background. And so we have some more little amounts of blue, a little pink. And we go into our special, we have some small half pearls. Okay, we have some, a little red. Three sizes and rhinestones. And then we have a few marquee. And we have these um, beautiful blue shards. I have quite a number of Christmas or holiday or winter type items now. So I was going to say this is kind of old. Sorry if that was loud, but the, the, the um, glue part of the packaging stuck to itself so sorry if there was too much crinkling there excuse me so I do consider this a winter item because you know he has his little winter hat on and the snowflakes um, but I have quite a number of winter stuff now so I don't know if I'll get to this one this year but here we go again a cute little happy Christmas bear or I keep saying Christmas it's really a winter bear Okay, I have two more items. 
I'm going to save the bu other bubble round for last. Uh, actually, you know what? No, I'll do that now. I was going to, but let's all keep them together. But this one's a smaller one. This is one of those tiny ones. It's an 18 by 18 centimeter. And it's so adorable. Look at it. It's a cute little bee holding its little heart. Look at his little wings and its little rosy cheek. Oh, isn't that cute? I don't even have to do much to show you this. It's, it's a smaller one. Let's see about the size of my hand. So that's really cute. And of course, since it's smaller, they only have a limited number, so they don't need to put you a key code or anything. Um, but we have, is this it? Well, I would, no, I'm opening the wrong one. I'm like, what? This can't be, right? <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. These, these gems giving me some craziness today. Okay, so here we have the background color, which is this pretty pink. And we have our medium. And we have our large. So the two background colors are the same color. But the large one is a lighter pink. That's not really nice. And we have our very pretty, one of my favorites, the, the clear but yet AB coated um, with static <laughs> um, di uh, rhinestones. Beautiful. Colors of the rainbow. We have a little black. Some three sizes of yellow, of course, for the bee. <clears throat> Excuse me. Some clear for the wings. Reds for the heart. A little orange. And some clear hearts that will go in the background as you can see and here it is on the website how adorable okay And finally, we have one more item. It is not a bubble round, but it is a special shape. Um, this one is uh, really pretty. And again, it's one of the kinds that there's a lot of negative space in the background, which usually I'm not a fan of, but, but this is so pretty that I wanted to um, see what it looked like when it's finished and I really like the design so uh, one second Doo -doo. okay here we go so here we have our item number it's a 30 by 40 and there are you see eight sizes and shapes and colors so we have basically our wedding lady but what I liked about this one is again the larger stones I'm a fan of on these partials having larger stones so you'll see she's basically outlined and in her veil with the regular size rhinestones or maybe half pearls or something through here but in her dress and in her flowers, she has mostly these larger stones. So that's going to be very striking. And again, with so much basically white throughout um, her dress, everything's basically almost probably white. And having her has a black skin. Beautiful. Beautiful. So uh, this is actually... Mm, 
Should I do this one or the B? You know what? I think I'm going to do this one because I'm going to do another smaller bubble round for another painting. You'll see in another time. So of this collection, I try to do, if I can, at least one item from when I um, get something to show you all. So I think I'm going to try to get this done. It shouldn't take a long since it is a partial. Um, and it's really pretty and I want to see how it looks. So here's what it looks like from the site. And let's look at our diamonds. So we have clear. Let's see. Then we have white, um, like a resin type regular drill. So the clear will be in little swirls in her dress. The white will be um, outlining her body and the dress and her veil throughout her veil then we have this an ab a blue ab well yes that is a dark blue it's like a navy blue um ab and that will be actually on her arms outlining her arms and her face and her hair then we have these small half pearls those will be in her dress and her veil. These medium sized half pearls. Also in her dress, we have these faceted purple, faceted purple. And let's see, those will be um, in her bouquet. We have these beautiful, th they give you three beautiful, these purple flowers flower diamonds um, and that will be also good thing there's three and they wish they would give a few more because all three will be used in her bouquet and finally we have these um, AB iridescent type teardrops and those will go in her dress again one last look So just a splash of color and everything else will be whites and clears. So I'm going to do this one. You will see this at the end of the video. I will tag it on um, right after in a few minutes. <laughs> so oh, let's do a recap, shall we? Of course, we just seen this, the beautiful bride. We saw our cute little heart bee. I'm going to call it Bev. Um, we have our winter bear, our cartoon pig, and we have our springtime wedding lady. That's what I'm calling her. So thank, I would like to thank you so much to DIY Buying um, for... Uh, your kindness i would like to thank all you wonderful dear friends true blues viewers lurkers so you know new new faces old faces all your faces <laughs> i'm kind of getting lost in my words now because i want i have so much going on in the in the mind that i'm going a little blank so with that i'll just say this final thing uh Please like, subscribe, all that stuff. Please leave comments. And remember, all of the items will be linked in the description box as long as well as my Facebook group with Angie. And please, everybody, I hope you all have a wonderful day, a wonderful week. Please um, be safe, be happy, stay safe, stay happy. And um, I was going to say until next time, however, until a second from now when you see the finished product. So hang on. Digiloo, 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 breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. <laughs> I have not one, but two finishes for you. Yes, two finishes. 
one I did as soon as I got this kit or this uh, package and the other one I just finished yesterday. So let's look at the yesterday one, the one I just finished. And it is, ta-da, my little Beverly Bee painting. It's a little bubble round, really, really cute. The bee holding a heart. This is a pure traditional bubble round with the three different sizes. That's all that's in here. We have our pink, uh, three different colors that um, in the background small medium and large that is a light baby pink not clear large stone we actually do have a couple special well one special drill i believe and it's uh these little hearts in here going around here and then we have our red heart our, our yellow bee and we have outlining it is those beautiful like ab coated type clear rhinestones some of my favorites it's getting close there beautiful and as you could see on this kind of bubble round usually when it's um, a rhinestone a uh, full rhinestone or a rhinestone background not black and white uh, you can the no guide circle seeing through beautiful so cute so there we have our first finish now our second one is a bride dum dum Da -da. Dum dum da dum 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 da dum and here she is. I love again that uh, her, her skin tone color. I love that they have a little pop of a purple in her uh, bouquet, and that's it. Everything else are these pearls, these large clear stones, abs more pearls i love her beautiful flowing veil she's outlined in a black ab to give her uh skin tone or her outline of her face some pop really pretty and down into her beautiful dress again this is a partial which i really kind of love it's not usual for me i don't like usually most of this empty space in partials but this one is was just stunning enough for me to be like you know what it's so beautiful and I actually possibly might get around to framing this one day. It, that's how much I love this one. I, I just think it's so regal and beautiful and uh, fantastic. I really love it. So there we have our two finishes. No problems with either of these. I didn't run out of any colors or any, any drills or diamonds or gems or anything. And um, everything was great. Canvas great. Glue great. <laughs> drills great. Girls great. Drill's great. Okay, I gotta go. So, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much to DIY Buying uh, for your kindness. And please, everybody, uh, thank you much to my True Blues, uh, my dear friends, and any of my wonderful new people that have come to the channel. I so appreciate you all. And until next time, please, everybody, be safe, be happy, and stay safe, stay happy. Okay? Bye, guys.